That's a nice day. Let's go outside. Anybody else want to go outside? Oh, look, they're already all waiting. Let's do it. Today is Saturday. Yesterday was Good Friday. I hope you had a good Friday. On Good Friday. Come on, boys. In the yard. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go, guys. So I want to play around with this today. And pressure washer. We've got quite a few other things we want to do as well. Come on, boys. Come on. In the yard. So all of that snow that we had in that uh, last snowstorm, all gone already. Didn't last long, and now it's heated up nicely. It's about 15 degrees today, I think. Not too warm, not too cold, but a perfect day to get stuff done. So I've got to edit a video for you guys first. Uh, I've got to put that pressure washer together, test it out, probably wash the truck or something, see how that works. Oh, I want to go to Walmart to get a chamois so that I can wash it here and dry it off so that it doesn't get those spots on it. And I might also, if I have time, go to our land. You want to be part of the vlog too? We may go to our land and uh, stock up on a little firewood for here so we can have more bonfires here. Because I'm running a little low. It's not too bad. But I'd like to have this all filled up here. So that in the evenings, when I have an evening like today, I can just sit out here and have a bonfire all day. All day, which takes a lot of wood. We have a lot of wood we can take from our land, so it's free firewood. We just gotta go gather it. That's the thing. Britt is at work all day today, so she left the boys at home all alone. We're gonna try our best to stay out of trouble. Okay, Diesel. Are you gonna help me unbox the pressure washer? Yeah? How about Chevy? Chevy's out here somewhere. Chevy, you wanna help me? Yeah, well, there you are. Hey. No, you guys don't want to help? Fine. Unbox it myself then. Here it is. This one. There we go. Oh, stop. Why is there a stop sign? I must stop. If you need assistance, blah, blah, blah. I don't need assistance. Come on. How hard can this be? You pull the cord, she starts running, you start hosing things down. Wow, that's pretty cool. So we've added oil, we've added premium fuel. According to the instructions, it should be ready to start. Let's see what happens.
pretty amazing, eh? And it's not even its highest pressure setting yet. It's got one more after that. I don't think I need that. I'm gonna strip the concrete right out of the ground if I do that. <laughs> yeah, giving the house a wash as I'm going because a lot of it's splashing up on the house there. That is amazing. Very impressed. I bought a microfiber or a microfiber wash towel for my truck as well. So I already washed my pickup. Looks better than when I went through that wash that I paid 15 bucks for. Free washes from now on. Well, I guess I got to pay for the water because we live in town now. We got to pay for our water. But once we live out in the country again, we have well water and all we got to do is pay for the electricity to pump it out of the ground. What? 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 <laughs> so I've been pressure washing all afternoon. Uh, I was gonna go to the land today and grab some firewood. That didn't happen. Because we got distracted with the pressure washer. <laughs> We're doing the whole driveway. The whole driveway. Uh, I forgot to eat lunch, so. What? Guys, you wanna come outside? Diesel? No, 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 the gate's open. Shoot. Come on, Chef. Come on. No, 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 I trust you. Okay, I'm gonna close this gate. See, you guys are good boys. Good boys, see? Hey, <laughs> you got pizza, man. I know, I know, right? So we did this whole area in here. It's just drying now. Look at that. And uh, we're doing the whole driveway out here as well. We're doing everything. It's taking a long time, but it's going to be worth it. It's going to look amazing once it's done. But I forgot to have lunch, so excuse me. You thirsty fella? It's been a busy couple of days. And that sunshine is just wonderful. So today is truck cleaning day on the inside. It's not perfect, but it is a lot better than it was. Getting everything organized. My tow rope, my uh, straps here to strap things in, my safety vest in case I need to change a flat tire on the side of the road or pull someone out in the winter time or do something on the side of the road. It's always smart to have a safety vest with you. So you can wear that, people will see you and hopefully move over. Probably not. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yes. Kiss the hand of your king. I don't think so. I ain't got no king. Come here. How about you? At least I got you. What's going on in here? It's vacuum. The vacuum? Vacuum. Vacuum. I ain't scared of nothing. Come at me. He's a demon that haunts dogs. Look who. Wiener's nervous. <laughs> he wants to hide by her feet, but she also has vacuum. He's always very conflicted whenever I vacuum. <laughs> very conflicted. Chevy, how about you? I'm nervous. He's hungry. <gasps> what? No. He's been he's been following me for the past little bit here. You hungry? I don't know. You don't look very hungry. For supper? Is it time for supper? Hungry? No, no one's hungry. I don't think anybody's Looks hungry. Looks from mom to dad. Dad to mom. Mom to dad. Yeah. Wash it with that vacuum. I'm watching you. All right. <sighs> oh, yes, lots of noise. Lots of noise and banging. Yep, it's right in here, Diesel. Your cord's all tangled. Thank you. All right, Diesel, Shelly. Mm hmm. Nice Easter supper for you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Senior recipe for the seniors. That's right. Special supper, Easter supper. That's right. You may not get Easter bunnies, but you guys get special suppers. Happy Easter, Commander. Wayner. <laughs> Should have called him Hoover. Hoover? That would have been such a good name for him. It's a Hoover. Or Vacuum. I couldn't come up with a name for him when I got him, so I let someone else name him. Oh. Friend at the time. I had no idea. Are you liking it, Chevy? I'm gonna show you guys my clean pickup. One second, let me unlock the doors. It's not the best. Oh, it smells like smoke out here. Oh, neighbors probably having a bonfire again. These neighbors have a bonfire almost every day. I like it. I like their style. Okay, so I've still got these seats on here. Oh, I gotta put the seat cover on the back yet. Yeah, I got the. Uh, I still gotta wash the floor mats, so it's it's not the perfect job. I don't know why I'm showing this to you, but uh, it is nicer. It's more organized. It is cleaner. I don't care if you don't believe me. My cleaning products down here. No dog hair. Just need to wash those mats. I didn't pull out the pressure washer uh, today. I was doing that yesterday and I cleaned this whole driveway. This whole driveway was black and I thought that was just the natural color of the cement. It took me all afternoon, but uh, we actually have cement colored cement now. Or is it concrete? I don't know the difference. I'm a truck driver. What? Looking a lot neater here, no big piles of leaves. So I feel like I made progress this weekend, made things better. Remember how black this was here when we were washing this off here? Look at that. Once again, not perfect, but a whole lot better. Come on, boys. Come join me. So I hope you guys all had a great Easter weekend. I don't know if you get Easter Monday off or not, but Easter Monday is not a holiday here in Manitoba. I researched it today and apparently it is observed in Alberta, New Brunswick, Quebec, and all the territories up north, Yukon, Northwest Territories, and Nunavut. But in Manitoba, only Good Friday is a holiday off work. So Monday we're back to work. Bring it here. Bring it here. Can I have it? Can I have it? Oh no. Oh no! <laughs> Do you get it? Yep. <laughs> now he's not gonna let Chevy have it. Diesel, bring it here! Diesel, bring it here! Quick! Chevy's not gonna let him. Are you gonna get all mad? Yep. Trying to bring it to dad, you're getting in the way. Diesel! This is why it doesn't work to play fetch with both of them outside. Hey, 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 guys! Guys, guys, guys! Give me the ball! Hey! Diesel, come here! Diesel, come on, figure it out. Get around him. Chevy, get out of the way. Come on. Diesel, let me have it. Let me have it. There we go. Okay, you ready? You ready? Come here. Come here. Give it here. Drop it. Drop it. Hey, Diesel. Drop it. Drop it. Let me have it. Diesel. Drop it. Now, drop it. Drop it. Let me have it. Goofy boy. You're done? You old man. I'm done too. I'm an old man too.
So I got a couple of gifts from my family today. I wanted to show them off to you a little bit. I've got this from my sister Cheryl. It says, don't hate me because I'm beautiful. <laughs> I love it. I'm gonna use it to store my pens for now. And uh, it'll be right on my desk right in front of me there. And a collaboration between both my sisters and my mom and dad. They got me this. It's a memory of me when I played hockey. Here's when I was really young. I played for the Mitchell Mohawks then. Uh, later on I moved and I played for the Landmark Blues and that was my hockey team. And this was actually my lace on my skates where we won gold. And that was the gold winning team. This was the article from the Carillon newspaper, March 27th, 2000. We were in the newspaper because we won gold. We were the champions. That was our team. Some of the best years of my life. Really love this. I can't wait. Uh, I think I want to hang this up. Eventually we're going to move those photos somewhere else yet, or those paintings. I think I'm going to hang it up like right there in front of my station here. Somewhere special. But for now, just so that it doesn't get damaged or anything, I'm going to leave this piece of cardboard on there. So that was a collaboration uh, from my mom and dad. Uh, it was actually uh, when my grandpa passed away recently, that newspaper was in their stuff and my mom uh, got it, uh, I guess after the funeral and she uh, thought she would like to give it back to me in a special way. So she waited for my birthday and made a nice little frame of it there. My sister Rose uh, tied up that lace in that intricate, uh, whatever you wanna call it there. <laughs> if I can get this open again. Oh, 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 there we go. She did that. And my sister Cheryl uh, made the frame because she's very good with woodwork and stuff like that. Both my sisters are, are very artistic and very good with that kind of stuff. And uh, that was a really special gift. Brings me back to the, the old hockey days. I miss it a lot. And I'm, I'm thinking the only reason I haven't been playing recently in the past like 10 years is because I've been a truck driver over the road. I haven't had time to, I can't be at hockey practice and beat all the games when I'm on the road all the time, right? So I figure now that I'm home all the time and home on a regular basis, maybe next winter I can join a rec league or a farm league or something if they let us play hockey by that time. So uh, silly that we even have to say that, but you know, maybe I can join a rec league and play hockey on the weekends again or something. Get me back into shape and also have a lot of fun. I miss it a lot. Uh, my buddy Tyrone, he's in that picture as well. I uh, grew up with him. Uh, he was my best friend growing up. And we played on the same hockey team. And he played in a lot of rec leagues. I'm not sure if he still does it or not, but this uh, coming winter, I think I'm definitely going to get together with him and shoot the puck around on an outdoor rink at least if we can't join a league. But anyways... That's it for this Easter weekend. Tomorrow's Monday and we're back to work. Hope you guys had a great long weekend. And we'll talk to you tomorrow.